Hello and welcome to this first introductory video for the Blinder Kitten software. Blinder Kitten is a software that allows controlling stage lighting using DMX or ArtNet. The software is completely free, open source, and without restrictions. It was designed for concert and theater lighting designers, but can be used for any application requiring DMX or ArtNet. To help you control your fixtures, Blinder Kitten uses a fixture system. A fixture is a software representation of your light fixture. Once your fixture is correctly configured and patched, you can select it and adjust its intensity, colors, and other channels without worrying about DMX addresses. Blinder Kitten writes where it is needed. Unlike other software and consoles, Blinder Kitten records the commands you enter, not the lighting states. This makes it easy and quick to adapt the programming of a show to a new venue or new fixtures. For example, if a group is used in a coolest, an effect, or anything else, modifying that group will update all those elements. The same applies to presets. Let's take a tour of the default windows, but know that the software interface is fully customizable. Each window can be moved and docked wherever you want. The first area in the top left contains all the necessary settings for configuring our show and the input panel. Just below that, we have the encoders that allow us to directly control the channels of our selected fixtures. Further down, the selection area contains the fixtures and groups present in the show displayed as a list and grid. At the bottom of this column, we have value, timing, and curve presets. In the center, the first area contains the coolest's, effects, and carousels, also in list and grid form. The next two areas contain an assignable virtual button matrix and virtual fatters. The last column displays the inspector and logs. The inspector is the software's editing window. If you select an object in a list, all its parameters and content will be displayed in the inspector. If you select an object from a grid, it will be called in the programmer and not in the inspector. For this series of videos, we will use Capture Student 2023 software to visualize our DMX output. We will communicate using ArtNet. The procedure to configure both software is available in Blinder Kitten's documentation and in the description of this video.